think the uh, hardest part was to write the book and to kind of recount the, the uh, events that happened on our journey. And once the book was written, they basically um, did the documentary from the book. They just did additional research in order to put the documentary together. But we are very proud of um, the work um, that Paramount and Viacom have done. We are, are very proud of you know, the producers and the directors, every, everything that everybody has done, we really appreciate it. It's, it's a real life story. It is very um, emotional. Um, it's very intense. Um, and they'll take the message away from them. As soon as they see the documentary, um, I believe they'll take the message away from them about awareness and about never forgetting. I think for, for, for us, it was, it's just, it's, um, we're humbled to, to have been able to use our voice, uh, to use what, what America deemed as a story. Um, it's, it's a story to America, but it's our lifestyle. And so just to be able to share our lifestyle, our livelihoods, what we've been through, uh, through a book and now through a docu documentary, is powerful. Um, and people will get a chance to look at the documentary and, and see and get educated on a lot of things that they had no knowledge of. And so that's, that, that's, that's one of the things that uh, uh, we wanted to be real informative. Um, the reason why it's so important because it continues to happen. Although um, Emmett Till was over 50 years ago, um, Trayvon Martin was six years ago, it continues to happen today. It, uh, gun violence continues. Um, there's a lot of hatred in this country. There is an issue with gun violence. There's an issue with mental illness. And we need to address these issues instead of uh, trying to sweep it under the rug and pretend like these things aren't occurring. We need to address these issues. And the sooner we address these issues, more lives will be saved.